Want to try cards against humanity again? Oh, I'm down. That's a fucking. That's if I can find it because there used to be a website for it. Well, as I mentioned beforehand, the website seems to be down at the moment. The, well, at least the website everyone used. Yeah, that was such a great website for all that shit. I don't know what the we fuck can... happened. I, if I remember correctly, what happened, and again, this is probably just, you know... Speculation? Speculation? Wait a minute. Is it act did it actually work? Wait, is it working now? Let me check. Okay, it's wor it looks like it's working now. Oh, uh, I'm waiting for it to load on my end. Could if somebody link me the website, please? Hang on. Yep, the website's back and active. All right, give me Yay. a second. Let me go ahead and put it in the uh, gaming chat. Meanwhile, yeah, I'm, uh, um, hang on. Where I don't it? have access to that gaming chat. Uh, oh, it's wait, like hang the on. the Screamy Boy exclusive one. Yeah, hang on. Sorry, Angel. Thanks. Oh, it says connection timed out again. Well, the uh... Really? I was about it didn't to say we could play me. charades, but that really wouldn't work too well. That's why the people of this world believe in garnet, amethyst, and pearl. Yeah, connection. And Steven! And Steven! Yeah, I might as well just do another thing with Jackbox. God, don't you hate it when you're trying to, like, click on something for it to respond and it takes, like, too fucking long? Oh my mm. god, yes. Totally yeah. get that. Mood. Very big mood. Also, I'm being a little narcissistic again. You're fine. You're fine. Where is... Okay, I don't know why I typed down all that, but whatever. Heron! Now, there goes my ears. Sorry, I need to lower, I need to fix the microphone <laughs> no, settings on this thing. Yeah, apparently in the uh, Discord chat, I, I I shared the link to my character dressed them in a belly dancer outfit once again. Is this a new one or an old one? It's the old one. Like, I can't get, get enough of that, honestly. Are you going to make any updates? Um, I remember, the only thing I remember is making some updates back in 2020. And I'm pretty satisfied with it. Like, okay. I, I managed to get the outfit the way how I wanted it designed, and I made him mm. very shiny. I made him very... I love the way he said It's cute! So cute. <sighs> uh, I am literally expecting just an, an audio clip of Golden Dancing and then just playing Hips Don't Lie in the background, because it, it just... Seems so obvious to use that song. If it was the one I saw, it's it's accessible through my DeviantArt. About to my hips don't lie. Oh shit! Rock person, my bad. Oh. Wait, did you just send like? He sent it to me by accident. <laughs> Whoops. Oh. To, to Angel Speed or uh, Rise? I accidentally me. sent it to Angel Speed. Oops. Oh. I love it. This is just him lying on a pillow. Yeah. Yep, that's the one. Okay, so like, yeah, all right, just... twist. I think uh, here, I'll just go ahead and share it here. <laughs> I get way, I have way too much fun doing shit with my character. Yo, can you guys believe we're almost at the end of the year? Yeah, yes, I can. Crazy. Honestly, I'm, I'm waiting. Really, like, I want this year to end because fuck 2022. Astrologically, it's supposed to be better next year. I you fucking hope so. hope so. Well, here's some fun astrology stuff if you don't know. Jupiter has station direct, so that means a lot of good things are starting to like things are going to start opening up for a lot of people. Things that you say you've been working on or trying to break through, they're supposed to be starting to maneuver away. There's been a lot of delays. Like say you try to make an appointment and it hasn't gone through. You try to be meeting up with somebody, it hasn't gone through. That sort of why, because it was in retrograde. But now that it's not, it should be definitely open up the floodgates. But remember that Mars is definitely in uh, retrograde. I want to say in. Uh, in a water sign right now, but I can't remember which one. 
And that means very much of a lack of motivation and drive. But you could definitely find the lack of motivation and drive if once you find something that really clicks with you. So what you're saying is Mars is our enemy. (laughs) Not really. You also might experience a low sex drive during this month. Oh, that explains a lot. You know, a low sex drive, I think that would have been appropriate for November. (laughs) <laughs> it's, it will be in retrograde until next year so yeah so I'm gonna try to actually set up a game oh hang on uh, I completely um, zoned out and talked about random shit and was beat oh god I'm getting deviant right now <laughs> twist the fate favorite um uh the the, the the harem thing oh twisty's, twisty likes it I mean, so far a lot of people love it. And I'm happy that they love it. It's a cute one. Oh yeah, it would actually help if I turn on the fucking screen share for that. (laughs) Silly. Kitty Lola, I, I didn't catch that. The only recommendation I can make is that if you're going to make, if you're going to, um... Um, if you're going to set up a game, put a password to it. Yeah. Oh, I Did don't I... think they have the, I don't think they have the MLP card pack. I thought we were playing Jackbox. Yeah. No. Like... Oh, I thought you guys wanted to play, um, Cards Against Humanity. The website timed out. Yeah, it keeps. Not for me. Bitch. It's it, not for me. Hmm. It, it's fine for me. I'm down with anything, to be perfectly honest. But, so. yeah, I'm down for anything, so. Alright, let's go ahead and just lower this. I'm gonna say... <coughs> Salut! Bless you. It's always twice whenever it comes to sneezing. Uh, trying to straighten out the... I just run, I run so far away. That's Pinkie Pie's theme. Or (laughs) at least to the people who try to run away from Pinkie Pie. Yes. I gotta go to the bat room again. Because I remember uh, the earlier, like, the season one episodes of Friendship is Magic. Like, Dash is trying to fly away constantly, one side after another after another, then all of a sudden... (laughs) It's like... She thinks that she out like lost the pinky all of a sudden. Hi, Rainbow Dash! Ah! And it just goes to the other <laughs> side. Pinky going at light speed, basically. Yep. Yes. A rumor has it. A rumor has it. A rumor has it. Has what? It's it's a song it's the song by Adele. Mm. Alright. I think it's one of her more forgotten songs that isn't rolling into deep or hello it's me every time i think of that song hello um what's it called uh fasting there was a video where a couple of uh um a couple of people who work out were um going through a fat like a fasting phase and they're mm-hmm. just like, and they're like, they're so hungry. It's like, oh god, it's like it drives them crazy. So they make jokes about it. And one dude is like waiting for like to eating his pancakes until it says like twelve o'clock noon. It's like, ding. And as soon as it like dives in, you hear hello. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta hello. find that video. It, it's funny as shit. <laughs> There's another dude who's make, uh, making making uh, all those. Uh, what is it? The five uh, death. Uh, the dot five stages of death or something like that. Oh, okay. Hello from the other side. I think it's intermittent. Yeah, it's intermittent fast <sighs> I just run, run so far away. Uh, what's going on? The fuck? Fuck What was that? 
I heard it too. Mm hmm. Um. No, Magical Star, that was not Ellie. Yeah. Hello, I've I've returned. What happened? What do you mean? What happened? We heard. We heard some... you yelling. Yeah, God damn heard... it! I forgot to mute. <laughs> <laughs> so I will. I so while I was right before I was going to the bathroom, I decided to check in my husband, saying, "Hey, do you need anything? Do you want a drink?" He said no. Caught him doing something. Like, I, I saw him doing something. I was like, what's going on here? And nothing bad. I was like, all right. And then I was like telling him that you guys play, were playing cards against me in the uh, Jackbox when you get that set up. And uh, he might join. Don't know. And then he started grabbing me where the sun doesn't shine and smack my ass. <laughs> what the fuck? So. That, that man. So far away. Now it's stuck in my fucking head. You're welcome. All right, so yep, twist the fate. <laughs> um, which Jackbox game are we playing? Oh, uh, hang on, I'm doing a couple of things at once. I was trying to find um, I was trying to find that one fasting video. Oh yeah, the because he wants me. He wants to show me that one. It it's... doesn't help that I'm in gym clothes. Cool. You know, Kitty. You know what's one meme I'm surprised you haven't done yet. Hmm. Have your pony drawn as Maria Maria Takanuchi, the the woman who did the plastic love song. Oh, I did a cover of that. I love that song. Oh, that song is so catchy. <sighs> I still find it so weird that literally that felt like the story behind the song, the video itself being on YouTube and the photo associated with it. It's just so damn hilarious. Right. It's not even the actual cover. I think the actual cover was like brown and like looked like a box. Yeah. But what I love is the story behind the, um, like what happened between the guy who uploaded the video and the uh, for the guy who took the photo because so like what happened was that when he up when the dude uploaded the song to YouTube like he just uploaded the song and that's it he's like like the song here's a cute little Jap uh, song by this Japanese woman here's a photo I found of her okay thanks bye but then the photographer who who saw the video on YouTube because it started getting a little bit of um, traction. All he wanted was just simple credit to his photo. He's like, you know, hey, do you mind if you can credit me in the video? You know, credit my work because this is something I took like years ago. So he caught, so he messaged the guy, but the guy hadn't used the account in years. So he filed a little complaint to YouTube, not realizing the complaint ended up taking the song down. Hey, Rustic. Hey, what, uh, Rustic. What are we playing? Uh, uh, Jackbox. Hang on, hang on. But the story does have a happy ending because the guy would later on come back to the YouTube account and he and the photographer would actually, you know, just sort out the situation and the do and the, and he would end up having the video would end up having the uh, the blocking removed from its um from it. What I dude... Oh, sorry. Yeah. What? Well, no, we, no, no, no. Okay, one. Are we playing Cars Against Humanity here? Yes. We I were for the website. Want... Uh, yeah, I tried. Yeah, there, there's a, like a website where you can play Cards Against Humanity for free, but the website keeps timing out. Ah, uh, that's why I clicked the link. It gave me a default like okay. search. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah I found so... a website that I found a website where we can all play Uno for free. Oh, is it more than four really? players? Hell yeah, I can do ten. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I wish I knew about that. If only right? a certain company uh, actually knew about that, um, ooh, ooh. Darn um Ubisoft. Ubisoft, yeah. Oh wait, hold on, that have to. You know what I'm really happy about, like having Plastic Love go viral. I am happy that the city pop genre is back and kind of mainstream. City pop genre. 
City you never Pop. Heard of City Pop? Okay, so Golden City Pop is a um, as the name suggests, it's pretty much pop music with a um, it's pop music with a little bit of a like nostalgic urban vibe to it. Yeah. So basically, and then a, oh, sorry, sorry mom. Oh, okay. Um, so basically, back in the eighties, uh, Japanese music was a mix uh, was a mixture of jazz. It had <laughs> funk. It had um, eighties new wave. And it had a blender, hell? basically, of them. And it's called City Pop. Yeah. Okay. It's fun. Golden, what's the code? Uh, H-R-W-B. H-R-W-B or B? How do I get into the game? B as a boy. Think Warner Found Brothers. Yeah. Thank you. How do but, I like, one of those pop... Ah! Herb. But, like, one of the... <laughs> <laughs> but like one of the most popular song, or at least one of the more popular artists of city yeah. pop is a musician is a young woman named Maria Takanuchi who got a lot of praise for her style of city pop music. Mm. But oh, she didn't. But in the West, she's best known for the song "Plastic Love," which has a really good and like sort of chill vibe to it. It does. I think I heard it a couple times before. What was the what was the name of the of the code again? Uh, H R W W B. Oh wait, there are all the slots are filled in. Wait, no, there's one, there's one, wait, no, there's one more slot left. Oh wait, no. Yeah, I, I can't get in. Yeah, you're gonna have to spectate, um, Kitty. Uh, yeah, it's fine. <laughs> but I, I can't get into the room. I typed in Jackbox. I can't even get in. Wait, are you on Jackbox TV? TV? Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, because I was gonna say, look at this. Oh, I thought it was well. I don't know. Alright. Let's have some stupid bullshit go on. <laughs> Let's have some stupid bullshit. Three. The Wrath of Schmitty. The Wrath of Schmitty. Schmitty. Schmitty Wireman Jetson. Here is George Jetson. <laughs> is his hat, Mr. Krabs? He was number one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> am I really going to defile this grave for money? Of, of course, course I, I am. am. Ah, so the Pantera reunion. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I really don't have a response to that one because I don't know what that means. Okay, long story short, the band Pantera announced a reunion, except that there are two members, two big core members that are dead. Yeah. Okay, I can join the audience. What the hell is a timeshare pitch? All right. All right. Uh you just give me a DM when the uh, round is open. If we're having a call real quick. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh... Everything that I've done. All right, I'm good. I have it. I think Cowboys. these might be pretty. Good. Okay, these might be pretty good. These... Cowboys from hell. I still Yo, can't you... play that solo. It's so intense. <laughs> Dimebag Darrell knew how to fucking shred, but that song is fucking difficult. Yeah. The only song I know from Pantera is that Broly song they did. My skin oh, is cold. tense. Yes, I love that song. <laughs> What's your reflection when you turn your back? Looking at unquestionable things on Google, the same things as me. <laughs> you know, reflections. When will my reflection show? Who I am inside. My reflection is don't look at my browser history. <laughs> I mean, yes. Yeah, of course. Oh, what audience get? Oh, it's a tie for audience. Next we have... 
It's easy to walk out of a timeshare pitch until they offer you blank. Pineapple on pizza? A trip to the yeah. upside down world? <laughs> no! Oh, God. I that like pineapple. I like pineapple pizza. Who doesn't like pineapple on pizza? A lot of people I, hate I pineapple I, pizza. Blasphemy! I love it. I love I, it. It's good. Okay, I'm gonna be it. honest. I'm gonna be honest. I've tried pineapple pizza. I really did try it, but I just couldn't. I, I tried. I didn't. I didn't like it. Okay. So I said, at least you tried. Ha! It, so. I won with Stranger Things. <laughs> the cow goes moo. The drunk cow goes blank. Oh um, God. <laughs> oh my god, wow. Come move me, well, bitch. I, well, I, 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 I like that first move one. Me, bitch. Well, I think I don't want to Damn. I like it. <laughs> That's a good one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The next big hit Broadway oh musical boy. is going to be about blank. Oh boy. Oh, uh, here we go. Two hobos throw and poo at each other. Elon Musk and his downfall. <laughs> I like that one. Yeah. I'll can just, we please? If I, can we? Oh. Can we please get a David Fincher movie like a Social Network, but with Elon Musk, please? Oh my God. Yes. I was robbed <laughs> by poo. Whiplash. Super whiplash. One day Elon Musk will own YouTube. <laughs> No! no! He would oh. he would destroy YouTube more than Susan has. True, oh. very true. Yeah. No. With a Johnson. <laughs> safe for Dude, work sex. There's friends, no such Johnson. thing as sex. Safe for work sex. Exactly. Yeah, there is. There's wholesome hand holding and wholesome <laughs> hugging and That's not true. touching. Oh, true. So in other words, nothing. Dude, your friends, I'm gonna Johnson. Pick the Johnson. God. Cause Johnson's funny. Well, shit. Sorry, Thanks, Johnson. Audience. Johnson. What? You and your Johnson, sir. With you and your Johnson. Yes, so finally someone got my reference. And what, what, defeats, what defeats rock, paper, rock, paper, and, paper and, scissors? and scissors? Um, the gas or lightsaber. Oh. Oh. Okay, I did not answer this one. This was not. This was not. That was not um, me. As a so also, really tough one. <laughs> I was about to say, oh, easy femur break. Steam I mean, if I want someone to. Uh, it's a you... reference to SCP, Golden. SCP. Wait, you've never heard of the SCP? What does it stand for? Um, secure. You know, restaurant is bad secure when the waiter says blank. Protect. Welcome to the Krusty Krab. Can I take your shit? <laughs> Squidward got ink. Squidward was Did so the done. Did the chef put extra cum into his chip? Hey! Oh, 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 oh God! Why? Oh, what the God. fuck? Well, that sounds more convincing. That's my vote. Yeah. Also, Holy okay. shit. Okay, so, Golden, to make a long story short, SCP Foundation is a, um, I guess you can say a writing project of a shadow organization that, that secures, contains, and protects anomalies that are a threat to the world. For the Krusty Krab one, I actually wanted to make a Jeff Dunham quote and go, Welcome to the Krusty Krab. Get your shit and get out. I mean, mm. that fits. <laughs> Ninja won. Yee. Yeah, he won the first I'm actually round. surprised you haven't heard of it, Golden, considering that many people like Markiplier have played the Containment Breach series. Well, also, I haven't been able to play a lot of these modern games because I can't stream them. Touche. Touche. All right, let's see what we got. Let's see. What the fuck is with this one? Jesus. Oh, God. <laughs> Great elevator music. Uh... No. I don't like this elevator music. Can my husband join next round? Yes. Gee, I want to join next round too. I didn't play. Yes. I'm gonna kitty. Yes. Nookie. No. Yes. But my hair. 
I need to get mm -hmm. a teasing comb. Ah, uh, really come on. Mm -hmm. Hairspray and some teasing. That'd be great. You're running out of time. Shit. Uh, uh, this one was, yeah, this one's the second one's a little bit rough with this one. The first one I think I kind of like. Well, this trying thing. to make the answers is like, it can be really difficult. Yeah, yeah, yeah. especially what kind of prompt you get, yeah. It's, uh, what did Leprechaun oh. say about how they appear in pop culture? Um, no, we are not good. slasher killers, it's fake news. Fuck you, Lucky Charms. I like that one. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> Funny like thing is, slash for killer. Okay, no joke. One time for uh, during <laughs> Christmas and stuff, uh, we were we were wearing elf hats and stuff uh, around the store that I work at, and a little girl asked me if I was an elf, and I go, "No, I'm a leprechaun." <laughs> yeah, yeah, and the man. funny thing is, she actually believed me. But why though? A team building oh. exercise that is far too extreme for most yeah. company retreats. I was trying to do like a the incredibly orgy porgy time among us. <laughs> among us. Um. Hmm. Eh, I got that one. I think I saw them vent. <laughs> but yeah, the mother was cracking up laughing, and so was I. Yeah, the fact that she actually believed that I was a leprechaun was just hilarious. <laughs> Among us! Let's see. Realistically, only... the third little pig should have made his house of. Oh god. Oh boy. Reinforced titanium, the bones of the wolf. So Damn! Jesus! That's dark. Oh, well. That's a brutal oh, turn. I fucking oh, love my that. God. You don't want to know. I was gonna say free Mold real estate. Are great. That you should be in the next hey, um, horror Forget movie remake. Yeah, if True. we're getting a horror movie version of Winnie the Pooh, we should definitely get a horror movie version of uh, the Three Little Pigs with <laughs> making the house out of the bones of the wolf's family. That would definitely be a good one. I remember recently hearing, like, oh, they're going to make a horror spin with, like... A gentler way to say low sperm count. Uh, hey, uh, you need oh, some you need some... Em near empty goot. <laughs> uh, yep. Riley, is that you? Hmm. Oh my god. Anyways, now, like, because I remember well, hearing about Winnie the Pooh Blood and Honey, and then there's, like, the announcement that, oh yeah, they're gonna make a horror version of Peter Pan. I am not surprised they're making a horror version of Bambi. You know why? Hey, yo. Why? Yeah, this because is for the, Clip Flash. Because the original novel is brutal as fuck. Oh, Jesus Christ. It so is. is the, so is uh, the original you story of Mulan. You can you're a middle child because you can break the fourth wall. Are the middle piece of the human centipede? <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, oh, As a middle child, I understand. <coughs> I'm an only child, sadly. I mean, I, it, the Bambi bug being dark doesn't surprise me. I mean, Fox and the Hound was just as dark, too. Oh, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Everything was darker in the 1800s. Well, the Bambi they were no. They were all dark to teach uh, kids lessons. What is a sexy vampire's biggest turnoff? Donald oh, Trump. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm going okay, that. that was funny. I, I yeah. had to. Oh, so that's what. Which explain? Which still doesn't explain how Bella got pregnant with Edward's kid. I don't understand what she saw in that man. She's literally like, ew. She has I mean, to be that. fair, Bella was kind of a sociopath. Yeah, she was. I only saw like a minute or three minutes of that movie. I I got tired within three minutes. I said I'm gonna watch something. Oh else. no! I know oh, what was going through. I know what was going through her mind at the time. A KFC uniform or a silver quill outfit? Jesus, dude! Anything blue or anything creative? Whoa! That is far. Jesus Christ! Okay, I'm going with the KFC one. That Shit. is like, Jesus. Uh, that's uh, like hostile. Jeez, tell I, us how you really feel. I was gonna say blues clues. <laughs> yeah, that would have been funny. True, true. That and it's a tie. Funny. Was round two as good for you as it was for me? Let's find out. 
There we go. Oh, hey, well, I'm second place. Wait. Uh, uh, okay. Nice. Oh, oh. all right. Thrip Riplash. Riplash. Uh, are we going against Mini this time? Thick Lash. Jeez. I, I, mean, think, I think Blue Griffin needs a hug. Let's oh. all give him a hug. Poor boy doesn't deserve it. I gave the Blue Griffin a hug. Hugs. Let's see. <clears throat> Alright, so. Oh, what's this? <clears throat> All right, uh, I gotta really think this through. Shit, damn it. Oz is gonna drive me crazy. What, how much do I have? Oh, shit. Uh, Oh, what was that? What was it called? What were those things called? Those. Um. Don't panic. Oh man, got that. All right. Uh... Oh, what's up, Panic Rick? <coughs> <coughs> Alright, let's see what we got. The three terms the cool kids are using for constipation these days? Okay. <laughs> Block pipes, knots in the guts, the dry shits, butt blocks, no goes hard to... Damn, dude. <laughs> Damn. I don't know what to pick. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I, think it's I, I was yeah. gonna call it the Alaskan pipeline. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Damn! Oh, <dude>. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh Damn. fuck, dude! Holy shit! I like the name Butt Blocks or really Hard Times. <laughs> the no goes. Three things that when you see them, you can't unsee them. Oh, oh no. Naked grandma, death Naked ass, grandma! Effect, old <laughs> song, anime tits, extra thick ass, the horror Michael Bay movies. <laughs> I gotta go with naked grandma. Naked grandma. Because naked I, grandma! I, I remember naked that from, I remember that, I remember that from Family two. Feud. It chapter that two. Oh no! Why'd you that. remind me of that? No! I also remember that being an answer on Family Feud. This guy goes, naked grandma, and Steve's like, naked what now? I remember uh, the reaction that Angry Joe had when uh, he was watching the trailer for It Chapter 2. It was like, oh, what are you doing, woman? Put your clothes on! Three terrible oh, brands of cereal. Here we go. All right. You thought, you thought it was an It Chapter 2 movie? <laughs> it helps, Cockula! <laughs> you thought... My life is an adult! <laughs> Damn it. Oh, an extra Pour it up, <laughs> the ninth oh. level hell, my life was an adult. <laughs> Oh. You realize when the okay, Intune movie was suddenly he grabs the Holy wall. shit! Oh, oh, oh my god. Golden, you got eviscerated. I would Damn. have been like crispy depression or something. Things you like really that. thought we would have inter uh, invented by now. Flying cars, teleporters, insert third thing here. Susan being fired from YouTube, swearing to customers, a fucking edit button. You know what? Yes! 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 yes. Oh yeah. Also, yes. also, yes. also, a replacement but uh video feature, which is true, because there's like sometimes there's spelling mistakes, there's like editing mistakes. No, you mm -hmm. have to like upload the entire fucking video and lose all your views. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, it's a feeling. Also, the swearing at customers thing. Yeah, I could. There's sometimes I get. <laughs> 
some customers that are just like complete assholes that yes. want to just. I deal with it. Like, Def and I deal with it every I already, fucking day. I already yeah, cussed I, I at them, so I won't get that. I do too. And it's like, I just want to say. Good job, Ninja. Holy oh, fuck. twist the fate. Wow. You win the internet on this one. Okay, no. so um, I just want to say before I start a new game, uh, please be respectful and wait for certain players to come in. I have to, like, let me sign in first to become, right. um, like, the VIP. Right. And, yeah, and um, I know that Rust accepted that he wanted in on the game. I just DM'd him. I'm actually gonna head off for the night, so I'll see y'all later. All right, have hey, a good night. Hey, 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 hey. May the horse be with you. Good night, again, man. All right. Ah, okay. Before you do that, I'm just gonna like I'm gonna poke him. Wait him one minute. <laughs> All right, so guys, give a save one spot for rustic. <laughs> there. Yeah, no, the, the video replacing feature, I never understood why they never fixed that. Like, every that other website thing. has something that you could just replace it with, but no, right. they, they do this. Yeah. <laughs> like, maybe they made an old video and that maybe they should change it because that has a copyright song on there? Did you think of that? No, of course not. All right. You, you feeling kind of yeah, shitty no, there, know. Ninja? <laughs> Okay, what's the four letter? Okay. Oh, right. Uh. Ah, oh, damn it. Somebody took the moon already. All right, I'll be him again. Oh. He didn't All get right. in. Uh, oh. Yeah, one of you is going to have to, uh, one of you is going to have to leave. Okay. okay. Um, Here, I'll do it. Uh, do I just hit refresh? Um. I actually. Am just here? exiting out of jackbox.tv? Hold on. I think you did. Yeah. What'd you say? <laughs> okay he said he can join next round all right let's do it oh no, kitty no. you have to select the kitty there we go all right oh uh, yeah oh now it's a full room okay <laughs> oh, no. uh claymation you know i like it when there's like different uh styles of animation and not just cg all the time yeah Oh, uh, is it? It is, says I have to create a new room, but no. Uh, we'll wait for um, Rustic will join the next round, Juke. So there's a Twitter needs an edit button so bad, and YouTube needs a video replacement feature so bad. Yes. That's that's that, that's kind of why I got that stupid copyright strike because I was trying to find a way to get rid of the um that 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 song I use. It's like you know you can let me replace the song and replace the video. But no, they won't do that. <laughs> what was his name who did uh, Get Out? Jordan Peterson? Peel. There we go. Am I able to put in... Uh... Yes, I am. Sweet. <clears throat> Uh. Hey, Golden, next round, can you, uh, have my husband come in first before like everybody else joins in so you can get like a spot i was gonna try to do that <clears throat> okay um like we'll have to have him join the call and stuff are okay. you having okay. twist are you having fun like favoring my stuff <laughs> name of an <laughs> award show that <laughs> celebrates the most mediocre movies of the year uh so in other words the oscars yes right, uh, pretty much the medians, the sympathy of Elon Musk. God, well, everybody keeps <laughs> like at this point using the Elon Musk jokes are like it's like it's become too much of a cheap shot. It, it yeah. feels like Don it feels like the Donald Trump ones at this point. To be yeah, frank. It's and they never, to yeah. 
And the Amber Heard one. The too. dude's a piece of shit, but Jesus Christ. I would have loved it if the, uh, in this one, I would have just said just the Oscars. Because well, their choices I think are the stupid meaning. as shit. Yeah. The worst thing about being really, really sexy. Oh, oh, um, oh, boy. oh boy. I wouldn't know. Uh, I am not sexy, so fuck you. Sexy Squidward. I thought Ryza left. Stupid hmm. sexy Squidward's had a skull. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> now, who's the lucky one taking Ryza's place? Um, I don't know who's into that, but okay then. <laughs> I don't know. Wow. Um. Def, is there something you're not telling us? Is there something? <laughs> what? No. Are you sure about that? <laughs> <laughs> the worst thing to say instead of I do at your wedding. <laughs> oh, no. I surrender. No. <laughs> 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 nope. I don't. Don't I don't that. know. I don't get the Jordan Peele thing. I, I, I thought I said by Jordan Peele. Okay, Jordan Peele's the movie director, and he directed the movie Nope. Oh. Oh, you yeah. know, it'd be really better if someone put "I want a prenup." What? I don't even know what that means. Okay, so a prenup is like right after you get married, you can instantly get a divorce. Oh God! And, then, and it's like a clear cut. <laughs> These are the most disgusting night we have, Sir Blank. Okay. Pete finish your Oasis of the <laughs> Liver. Oasis of the Liver! <laughs> I mean, for Pete Fetish, you could just put in, I don't know, Omarashi. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Either Eden or Buttons. Oh! 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 Play what? buttons, what? Bad people, bad it's, people. It's 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 a whole okay. I will link you a video that's an hour long that explains the details on a it. A truly innovative technology, technology would be you. Blank pants <laughs> and headphones. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's good. That's fucking good. I would definitely, I definitely would love the right. first one, like the Karen canceling headphones. I would definitely like that. Yes, please. Oh. Yeah, well, well. I, I think the butthole one was great. <laughs> yeah, that was was son. What toddlers would buy if they had mad cash? The titty. titty. A lifetime supply of ice cream. When they say dead titties, they're not saying dead titties, are they? So, if so, uh, no thanks. <laughs> <coughs> oh, damn it, titty show. <laughs> Stop already. We know enough about blank. Oh, boy. How shitty toxic fandoms can be. Oh, God. Ellen's humiliation <laughs> fetish? <laughs> like, no, no, I'm gonna go with the no. fandom one, because, yeah, fandoms are disgusting, and, um, yeah, I still cannot forgive when that one fan artist at Steven Universe got criticized to the point where she almost committed suicide. Oh yeah, that Ooh, was a yeah, yeah. Thing. I didn't even know about, about that one. That. Yeah, yeah, um She got criticized for literally making like Rose Court skinny and she was just doing it to make cute art and everyone's like, Are you fat phobic? I never watched Kill Bull, but I know about the ref but I know a little bit about some references to it, so And of course let's all never yes. forget the Sash Sans controversy from Rick and Morty. I love it. That. That, that was my favorite. Oh no, the episode was fine. Wubba Wubba dub the, dub. The people I'm were all Rick. just and people of like were all we want Sesquan sauce. Like they were being so entitled. Oh yeah, 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 yeah first yeah. place. I actually remember when the pickle Rick meme was still going on and everything. We when we were selling Pringles and stuff, the pickle player ones. There was actually a pickle Rick uh, picture on some of the print on the. Pickle I, flavored uh, Pringles. I, do, I will say I love the Pickle Rick episode. Same here. Um. Oh, fuck. I forgot his name. Damn it.
Wait, is there room on the That's all dark team. Mm, I got oh no! Okay, we're good. Alright. I got my headphone on. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Something you might overhear in the back cave. <laughs> Bruce's deepest and darkest secrets. Catman's audible crying over crypto. I would have said uh, him crying to dead parents. <laughs> Yeah, uh, I would have, I would have said, I would have put, put him masturbating the Joker. Oh, Joker. Ooh, the tie. Oh, the tie. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> oh, what an extremely nice bouncer says when throwing. People... What an extremely nice bouncer says when throwing people out of bars. Please come back to most tavern, my lady. Don't ever come back. Uh, Ips Fedora? Uh, I don't know. I think I'll go with that one. Alright, who's not voting? Who's not? Oof. Oh. I couldn't think of anything good, so I just went with most tavern. People would pay good money to but. see historical footage of. Oh, God. Bill Clinton's sex tape. <laughs> Washington <laughs> Cross in the Delaware. Oh, wow. Two I'm going to go with that one. That's pretty good. I, I would not want to watch the sex tape. I do not want to see an old man fucking somebody. But all the blackmail you could do. But I've been... Thank you, come and get cancelled. <laughs> Thank you, come again. <laughs> this tape is, this tape is entitled the Quick Bar. I approve this tape message. <laughs> the name of a movie that only uses footage from a car's rear camera. Rear end. David Cronenberg's fantasy. What? <laughs> Oh my god. That's <laughs> high times in my trunk. He's the guy who did the infamous um, fly. It's got 50 50. Alright. The emergency room is so stressful. Why can't we just call it. Blank? The healing center? The get help room? <laughs> <laughs> That's actually more accurate. The yeah, yeah. Home. Get help! <laughs> I would have probably said, um, uh, the tel telemarketer hang up, uh, waiting, call waiting music or whatever. The ouchie layer! <laughs> the ouchie room. The ouchie room. <laughs> the, after the wheel and the fire, what was human's their discovery? Humanity's discovery. Yeah. Oh, these are really good. Ugh. I don't know. When I was in school, I don't think anybody... I still don't think anybody discovered condoms whenever I was in high school. No, but people are going to be on social media more. True. Yeah, yeah. I got this one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. It seemed too that's, why I, that's why I chose social media, because I was yeah. like, oh, when I was they in high school... Step one, approach the bank tellers. Step two, blank. Give them all the money and my <laughs> dignity. Sing, let it go. It's. Let it go. Let it go. Oh, God. Give me the money. Stop singing it. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Give me your go. fucking cash from right now. I will not stop singing this fucking song until you give me your money. Damn! Holy flash! Wow! Damn! Oof! Way to go, Star Flash! Way to go! I'm yeah. gonna have to see. I will see the Filthy Frank version from the go. This 3D money. fantasy adventure is so real you can actually blank. All right, let's see what we got. 
Oh, yeah, we <laughs> you. Oh, look, I've been impaled. That's the, okay, that's the rainbow. Remember, kids, if you die in the game, you die in real life. So be careful. Wasn't I'm going with the get killed part just because I love watching Sora online. Wasn't there a guy that actually made like a VR headset that can possibly kill you? It, yeah, he um act he was planning to make it because he took inspiration from, ironically enough, Sword uh Sword Art Online. Wow, uh... you could tell he loves his anime. Hmm. I mean I love my anime too, but I don't wanna get myself killed over it. Sure. <laughs> Alright then. Alright. Something clever, something witty, something clever and witty. Hmm. Three. Oh boy. Hmm. Was it something clever, something witty, and then something clever and witty? I think so. I think so, yeah. Okay, I could have done better with this one. God damn it! I could... This one, this was a shot in the dark. Yeah, the same one. Same. I feel like I'm never mm -hmm. a good enough comedian. Same. Right. You're better than I am. I'll... That's for sure. Bring the dinner. Fruitcake, Adam Sandler movies, the three-year-old son whiting. Eh, I like fruitcake, and I love Sa Adam Sandler movies. Well, Same here. the earlier ones, yeah. I'm yeah, sorry, the earlier ones. Three year old yeah. whining got me. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I sound like I sound like a, I was doing an impression of Squidward. And oh Muffy. come on! Damn it! Never underestimate the power of Adam to live <sighs> ten years longer. All oh, right. Boy. Diarrhea from a homeless man. <laughs> Anything deep fried in oil. The secrets. <laughs> the secret sauce. The secret Alcohol, sauce. fast food, ice cream. I was gonna say the pink sauce, isn't it? I mean, I was, uh, yeah. Uh, I've... I heard bad things about that. Like people dying. Well, shit. what's even worse is that the co-founder who made the pink sauce was so condescending to someone who was constructively pointing out a couple of health problems. When people On are saying pink TV. Sauce. When people are saying pink sauce, I keep thinking Pepto Bismol for some reason. No, I yeah, think that too. It looks like Pepto Bismol. Upset stomach. Uh, area. Need, uh, to get good, truly get ahead in life. Give him head. Swiping left on life. Pirating crypto. Andy girl. Money. Common sense. Common freaking sense. Yeah. <laughs> what is this uh, common? What is this common sense you speak of? I know, right? Because I, I can't think of anybody that has that nowadays. Okay, well, I mean, so like on Twitter. I'm considering showing this to you guys. <clears throat> the um, just the, that video clip of the pink sauce, because like it's infuriating. The three worst materials to build your house out of: uh, oh, cardboard. Boy. Chocolate, political lies, stuffed animals, shit, YouTube ads, and Karens. Hmm. I was gonna say bricks, sticks, and uh, straw. <laughs> oh, wait, I, I'm having I'm having trouble to figure out the difference between shit and Karens. 
Also, breadsticks would have been nice, dude. <laughs> we can go for a breadstick. Chocolate? Did you say chocolate? Yes, sir. With or without nuts. <laughs> Aww. And I still remained in seventh place. Holy shit. Ninja won twice. Okay, I'm gonna get my husband in now so that yeah. he can play the next game. Okay. okay. Maybe you should, like, stop sharing Jackbox so that randos don't jump in. Yeah, so I'm just gonna go ahead and see if I can find, uh, not that, not that. Alright, there we go. So. Hey, we go. Hello! Okay, what's the four letter code? Mm hmm. Yeah. Uh. What? Should I, am I coming in at a bad time? Oh, four. shit, this is still up. My bad. <laughs> Hello! Alright, um. <sighs> Hello, Cuphead. <laughs> I'm kidding. Hi, guys. <laughs> It sounds like a real, real delicious carbonara. By the way, season three was fucking awesome. I still have to catch up. I got yeah. him. He's in here. I'm cool. here, but I need to know what the four letter code is to get into the room. Well, I haven't started yet. I wanted to, um. I wanted to share, um. Oh, okay. Ads. I'm gonna go ahead and switch this over and um, I'm gonna change. Uh... All right. Um... Yeah, I wanna change it, please. No, 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 no. There. And here we are. Thousands, if not millions of people use social media as a financial resource, a way to support themselves, which is great. But one mistake on social media when running a business could cost you more than you think. Oh, right. Uh-oh, like releasing that episode? Man, there's been a lot that's happened since we released our last video on this topic. So to catch you guys uh. up to speed, there's a self-proclaimed TikTok chef by the name of Chef okay. P. Chef P created something called turkey. the pink sauce. Well, at first it seemed like an interesting product, yeah, but when people started too. ordering it, it came like this. Oh my God. No. Do Look at all the turkey? Definitely no. not as advertised. There are all kinds of typos on the bottle. It said it had 444 servings. Take the remainder of this turkey with off. you, too. And while all of this was happening, <laughs> Chef P was only talking about Here the positive go. reviews to her sauce and completely ignoring the justified the criticism. <laughs> that was until she finally addressed it on a live stream where this happened. Did, you, you, did, you, did you gobble it down? I don't sell many oh, yeah. products. I love so you, that made dark people meat. worried, yeah. to say the least, and suddenly everyone who consumed this were questioning well, what did sure I just all eat. And while all this was happening, there was also a creator by the name of yeah, Lord Beauty who was also go, criticizing right? the product. And she made a review on the product, which was not great because oh, it wasn't Lordy. a great product. I mean, TikTok even labeled people trying the pink sauce with participating in this activity could result in you or others getting hurt. And this is where the whole plot took an unexpected turn because apparently there's a talk show by the name of Karamo Show. They invited Chef P and a Lured Beauty to hash it out on his show. And this is off the back of Allie announcing that she would reveal the pink sauce test results on the talk show. But the show was clearly set up to make everyone feel bad for Chef P and to shame a Lured Beauty for criticizing a subpar product. Because listen how they framed this. There was a packaging mistake. So initially, 
someone who received the first order was someone that I knew personally. Mm -hmm. So she called me like, girl, my package looks horrific. Yeah. And so then I was like, okay, we have to put it in. Like, we have to stop all of these orders, contact each and every customer. We contacted everyone directly, meaning single emails, and let them know, hey, the shipment got damaged. We're aware <laughs> of this. We will either refund yes. you or send you a brand new bottle of okay. pink sauce. And, you know, we did offer exclusivity, like, um, you coming. know, just special offers to our customers, um, letting them know, like, hey, we care. And you handed your business like yeah. a boss. She was like, da, I made it. Well, we find da, out later da. that this wasn't true because she did no. not call are you guys watching the screen share? Yeah. I am. I'm in the screen share. Okay. No, I saw that Rustica was singing the Jeopardy theme. Like, do you not know what's going on? No, I have no fucking clue. I'm just here. -ish. Yeah, I thought we were going to start another game, so I invited I was. Him. I'll start a game in a bit. I just wanted to... Oh, that was oh, fine. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so on the surface, like, okay, yeah, so there's a shipping mistake, and you're willing to do either, you know, send a refund or just deliver the same product again or with better shipping. Like, okay, on the surface, that sounds good, but then things start to take a turn for the worst. Contact Alert Beauty. But this is where they decide to single out one critic who is Alert Beauty on the talk show. When did you start receiving the backlash, and what was that backlash saying? Okay, so there was a young lady on social media. She took it as the moment to say, hey, this is my moment to become viral. But she paid $20 plus shipping for a subpar product and she rightfully criticized it. I don't see an issue with that. People make reviews of products all the time. Fix the product if it's valid criticism and if it's not, ignore it. All right, when we get back, we're going to talk to one of your customers and fellow TikTok influencers, Allie. I think she's one of the people that you said kept on with the harassment, right? Yeah. See, this is what really confused me as well. How is making TikTok videos criticizing a product harassment. She's criticizing a product. The product had a questionable smell and then she found glitter in it. So she sent it to a lab. That's within her right to do. So to fly her out to a talk show, then single her out as some person who's leading a harassment campaign. That's just a weird thing to do. But then they bring out Allie, who is Allured Beauty. And then they have this whole weird moment where Chef P grabs her hand and tells her that she is not special. You're not special. She's the customer. <laughs> like what? She's supposed to be special to you. Yeah, that's just absurd, but we did cover that in our previous videos on this topic. And then the whole talk show takes this odd turn where at the end, Karamo says this. I think this is a moment of reflection. Absolutely, and I think it's a mo moment of learning on both parts. I think the learning is more on your part. Yes. Okay. And that's being real. And then being, this is being real here. Because I literally, the thing is the matter of that she is, her business, her, her livelihood, her safety is being a Nobody cares. Yeah. And these are things What's that about we those don't damn think squash about. Squash commercials. This moment is for you to realize oh, that yeah. your power is really in what you're saying and what you're doing. And that one video that you did for that second, the follow-up video, had ripple effects that you have to acknowledge is there. Because if it was on the other foot, you'd be sitting here upset, crying, mad. If you upset, crying, and mad over someone's legitimate criticism. Think about that. Do these people not know what reviewers are? You had to move every week because you and your child were in danger. Absolutely. So at this no, moment you for wouldn't. you just to say, you know what? Next time, I will take this step. Before I post something, I'm going to do my research. Before I do something, I'm going to reach out to her. She Before did do her research. Like, um, literally, have... she sent this to a lab. Uh, also, if I missed the, the second Jack, the new Jackbox game, it's because I'm getting my sister McDonald's, so. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Do something. I'm really going to realize, is this really my responsibility? Your responsibility is to build each other up as women. I'm kind of dumbfounded every time I hear that rant. She's the customer, and he didn't do his research. Then to top it off, they never revealed the pink sauce test results. And when I asked Allie about this, she said, I... A 
am not positive. They were really welcoming. And I guess it just wasn't something that was important at the time to the network. Yeah, because it seemed like they kind of picked the narrative they wanted to go with. And anything that could interfere with that, they probably threw to the side. This blew up massively in his face. So much so that the comments on his new YouTube videos are just flooded. Imagine gaslighting and shaming a customer for being rude and toxic when the person who created the pink sauce straight up called her not special in front of a bunch of random audience members and had them clap after she said that. It's pretty obvious who the toxic person is. Can you imagine how horrible that must have felt? Shame on you as the host for not even acknowledging pink sauce's mistakes and harassing the customer. Cowardly of you to take down the pink sauce interview after you unfairly tore into the concerned woman for rightfully critiquing Chef P. Like it was her job to inform P of everything that she she was doing wrong instead of the responsibility being on the woman <laughs> whose business it is to do her own homework before shipping sauce that could possibly sicken people. Never in my life has a talk show host shocked or disappointed me more than when you told the victim the learning was more on her part. After blindly taking such a bizarrely biased position from little to no evidence or prior research on the topic, you used your platform to promote gaslighting. Is that really what you stand for? I'll be sure to tell my friends not to watch your show. Yeah, that's just a handful of them. But the story continues here because Chef Fee actually finally addressed the whole situation or well kind of hey y'all this kind of reminds okay, me of so something i know i haven't been active on my socials lately i've been really busy behind the scenes working closely with dave's gourmet developing the pink sauce and i know like a lot of things have taken place i've been reading y'all comments and the things that y'all have been saying i want to say first of all that i do take accountability for the mistakes that i have made and the things that have taken place place hey that's accountability um however uh-oh here we go i had a very limited amount of resources at that time being a one woman army there are some things that i did not know there are some things that i am enlightened to in a lot of ener enormous amount of things that i've learned in the process of all of this you know with over half a billion people knowing about my bread my brand becoming a nationally known brand uh, within 30 days is, you know, beyond one of my biggest dreams and beyond anything that I could have imagined. This whole experience is extremely, uh, I'm growing a lot. Like For some reason, she still didn't apologize to Allie. Starting a business is tough. And I feel like a lot of people would have given you slack if you just admitted your mistakes right away, rather than going on to a talk show, singling out one critic and then blaming her for a harassment campaign on you. All you needed to do was own your product, admit its own faults, and tell the world what you're doing for that to never happen again. Clearly, she's working with a large company now, so I'm very confident they're not going to release some half-assed product now. It's just a shame that she smeared her own brand like that. She then goes on to say that she now has mentors and she thanks people for the continuous support, but there was no apology there. And that video was released two days before the recording of this video. But I did receive a message from Ali today where she said that she received a long-winded apology from Chef P. So this story has had some progress, but maybe Karamo needs to do some research himself and apologize to Ali as well. Because in my interview with Ali, I could clearly tell she was scarred from going on to that show because she still thought that she was in the wrong. But the talk show is now deleted off YouTube, so maybe Karamo is just hoping that people will forget. But who knows? Only time will tell. The internet never forgets. No, it does not. Of course. And the way they were talking about that kind of reminds me is like, like when they say you invited someone on there or for this or that and that. It's like it reminds me of uh, when ever people invite like Gordon Ramsay to their or restaurant and stuff to get like his advice and his help to make their restaurant better and all that. And yet then they don't like take his advice and they just uh, get in a big fight with him. That's what kind of part of it kind of reminded me of. If that makes sense. It's, it's just infuriating. It's just... Uh. So yeah, I, I just... I needed to vent off of that. Oh. Anyways, we're here to have some fun. I'm sorry mm -hmm. if that went a little too overboard. Alright, so... No fun. Um, just letting you guys know. Uh, let me sign in first, and I'm going to wait for Rustic to join in. So, give me... I do the whole time, Bubba. Alright. Ooh, crummy. Skinny. <clears throat> yep. All right. Go ahead, Rustic. All right. I'm in the chat box. What's the four-letter code? <clears throat> K. 
K-I-M-C. Hey, there we go. Nice. Oh, I gotta select a character. <laughs> I love the twist of fate is quoting that one, um... Because I know what he's referencing. A big mistake in the interview. I'll delete it. No one will ever know. Yeah. The internet never forgets, dipshit. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, I love that. Yeah, dude. Babe, why is your name Uncle Rustic? Good question. Oh, you mean in the chat? Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, there was a reason behind that. Oh, because it was a joke to Uncle Ruckus. Why y'all gotta be like that? The Dover <laughs> Boys, that's where we're. Alright. Oh, no. Uncle Russ, dick. Uncle Ruckus. Okay, I gotta see if Chrissy has any leftover carbonara. I'll be back in just a sec. Okay. Ooh, uh... After what? Oh, sweet lord. Looking for a uh, carbonara. Oh. I thought you said carbonara. I was like, what? It's some kind of alcohol. Oh. I'm not sure it's the one that she decided to make with the Skittles. Mm -hmm. Though I wouldn't... Babe. What? We're gonna go out and buy some Skittles and some alcohol. I wanna make experiments and mistakes. No. I wanna make mistakes. I wanna make bad choices in life. Please. Please. Isn't that what the internet's for? Traditionally, it was used for uh, communication, but then people decide to bastardize it. But some things have come good, some things are not. Yeah. Why do these crackers taste fishy? Babe, where'd you get these crackers? Uh, Dower Store. That's probably why they came. Yeah, Dollar Store decided to do something stupid in my area. Like, they build their store, like, right across from the store I work at. Okay, sorry about that. Nope, that was the last of it. It's definitely rich and delicious. All right, uh, yeah, everybody's in. Let's go ahead. Let's rock and roll. Yeah. I'm magically delicious. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Minaki. There's bound to have something up there. And if that's not enough, they have something called the Wayback Machine. Number one. Number 15. Burger King foot lettuce. Get out. Burger <laughs> King foot lettuce. Get out, leave right down, sir. What the <laughs> Okay. You know what? That could work. My second one's gonna be kind of fun. Though. The name of Snow White's millennial <laughs> age. Or, oh <laughs> no, Melvin the introvert, little peep. <laughs> I like Melvin. <laughs> Melvin the introvert. <laughs> <laughs> Melvin. 
my name is Melvin. And now I'm thinking, Melvin, Melvin, <laughs> brother of the Joker, Melvin, Melvin, no. brother of the Joker. <laughs> the internet never forgets. Nope, not of course wrong. not. You're not wrong on that, yep. Chick someone who's been a veteran, someone's been a veteran of the internet for so long, yeah, I never forget. Yeah, 500 years ago, freckles were called what? French spots and skin splotches? Oh, God. They're I don't know what that is. menaces, and I want to rip all mine off. I hate them. I want to laser them off all over my body. Babe, I'm bleaching my skin. I'm going to run my freckles. Okay, your agreements. Great. <laughs> now we just need to fund the project. <laughs> it's given. A cocktail you make for sad occasions. Oh. Oh, oh, oh boy. Tears so, and like, bleach with the sight of news. Warm flat. Ugh. Oh God. Uh, like uh. I, if I got I that. I would have said, "Daddy's cummies." <laughs> Dude. <laughs> I'm gonna throw up now. I would have done the sad violin. You got an extra barf bag? Let me play some of the real sweetest. Oh, spade. Angel of Speed. Wow. Holy shit. Yeah, the war fun very sad, pretty funny to me. Uh, the modern shit. pirates don't steal treasure, they steal blank. Uh, oh, this movies? should be an easy one. Rum and jars yeah. of dirt. <laughs> Disney <laughs> media. <laughs> oh, that's good. That's a great Disney one. I love media. that. I got a jar of dirt. I got a jar of dirt. At this point, at this point I can it. imagine, I can imagine the piracy of like, Taking all the Disney remakes, watching them just to say how crap they are, and save people the money from spending them to go into the theaters. Well played, Magical. Well played. Yeah. I got a job, though. A fairy tale that never caught on. Blank in the... Oh, God. Depression. My <laughs> <laughs> <My> little sister. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, God. My stepsister in the beast. Oh, oh God. God. I gotta go that one. Both are horribly fantastic. <laughs> yeah, no, I love the depression one. Depression in the beast. <laughs> Cribbling that in the beast. Aw, oh, damn. Oh, Welcome right. back, Riley. Uh, GG's, oh. Oh. I actually do struggle with that a bit. Hello, Wiley. No, but actually, that was actually a pretty good one, too. The worst hey, thing to find on your belly. Oh, God, what? Oh, oh no. Um, on wow. Bellicle <laughs> cord. Oh! What? That's nasty. That okay. rustic. That was you, wasn't it? Actually, it wasn't because I'm looking at him right now. The worst thing to find your belly button, your mom. Technically, they're both the same answer. <laughs> <laughs> that Damn. is actually true. Fuck me, dude. I mean, <coughs> I think that Angel of Speeds is much more specific. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yo, let's. Sennheiser is a good brand, right? <sighs> Book adaptations have gone too far. Now they're making blank on ice. When it comes to headphones? The emoji. Yeah. <laughs> Bronies on ice. I heard they're very good. <laughs> the emoji movie on ice. That's just... The emoji movie on ice, that's just freaking... Oh, what's that? Sport in Canada. With the... <laughs> Hockey? Rolling? Oh. No, not hockey. It's with the little the balls and it slide. Curling. curling. It's curling on ice. That's all the emoji movie would be. It's just <laughs> curling balls in the shape of emoji. I don't know. I would. I would like to see bronies on ice personally. Same. I, I want to see them dance. Oh. oh dang! The chat. The chat got me the victory there. A shocking thing to discover: your kids built out of what? Oh god. Oh no. A working time machine. Really? I'd go with the time <laughs> machine. I mean, we all made yeah, a piece just, out of Legos. They, they <laughs> built the TARDIS yeah. out of Legos. I they mean, built I would, a I DeLorean would've... out of Legos? You know, that would actually probably be more expensive than just buying a DeLorean. <laughs> I think they're only now just expensive because of the novelty of the Back to the Future movies. Yeah. Unless you can buy them dirt cheap. If you do, babe, can I have one? Please? Please? She wants no. to revisit the. <laughs> she wants to revisit the eighties. 
Mm-hmm. I really, I couldn't if tell. If you want, you could just rebuild all the pieces from scrap metal or something. If I could go in a time machine, I would love to go back and meet Elvis Presley. I wouldn't. He's a womanizer, <laughs> and he's like a real douchebag, actually. Oh, I, found out. Much. I mean, he's only good oh, for sex. Get me a peanut butter and something. I'll be, uh, <laughs> you get past the electronic space, you brush this riddle. Let's Wait, should, should I use that or you know what? No, maybe maybe I'll go with that. <laughs> oh my god, it is too late. Uh, uh, okay, I'm gonna go with that or that one. Um, no, if I. Hmm. I can't say enough how much I love the claymation in this. Claymation's fun. It can also be creepy as fuck. Oh, you mean like uh, that the Mark Twain film? Oh yeah, that one. The one by uh, Will Vinton, I believe. Same guy who did the California ah. Ranger. I didn't get to answer the second one. There's a documentary about him now. Hmm. <laughs> Animat did a thing about him. What, his, uh, what do super most? progressive schools give instead of grades? Oh boy! Oh, a new no. gender. <laughs> <laughs> God damn! <laughs> cash prizes. Uh, gender. Constructor criticism and cash prize prizes. That would be Squid Game. Sure. Yeah, that would be. But the I new still haven't seen it yet. Oh, God damn! Both of these are actually really great. Oh shit! Let's go, fam. Which one? A new gender one. A new gender. Oddly enough, the winning project of the World Science Fair is blank. I was also going to go with the big game, but that works too. North uh, Korea's missile fails. I really want to the site or the science fair is a trip to Uranus or the North Korean missile. <laughs> uh, it just reminds me of this video where this guy is oh, showing these kids uh, the plants and stuff, and he goes, There's your anus. And the kid looks at his dad and goes, Dad, yeah, where's my anus? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Damn. I still want it. Yeah, no, this one was just like, eh, I'll just think of a generic joke. To get past the internet troll under this bridge, you must answer this riddle. Oh, God. Oh, boy. Cash what, what grass or ass? No, I cross for free. <laughs> What's cringe, but not funny uh, cringe? Hmm. Oh, wow. Uh... Why do I feel so targeted all of a sudden, even though I'm not under a bridge? I think I'll go with this one. Really, that one? Let's see. <laughs> yeah, I figured. Have you I read know. My Little Dashy? That would have been my answer. <laughs> or My Little Pony. Yeah, have you heard about him? A lyric you will never hear in a punk rock song. I like Square, but... And I cannot <laughs> lie. Jesus. Oh, uh, actually, there is a punk rock song you know that has Jesus in it. So, apparently, the red jumpsuit apparatus are like Christian punk rock. Meh. Like the only song I know and remember from them at Moses Face Down. Like that was their one hit. That wonder. was. They had another good song too. I can't remember the name off the top of my head. The but... album Don't You Fake It had a handful of like interesting songs to listen to. How it's a society spend its time if Netflix didn't exist. Blockbuster will be bought from the dead. More Twitter drama. <laughs> More Twitter drama. More drama. More Twitter drama. 
I would love I'm sure Misanthropony would be glad if this happened. I'm gonna bring Why? You back. He hates Netflix. Oh. I would bring Blockbuster back yeah. from the dead, and we would all have video rental stores all over the U.S. again. Yeah. They cost yeah. like five bucks a day you know, ironically, when, they, when they died. You know, ironically, Blockbuster freaking <laughs> had the opportunity to merge with Netflix, and they turned them down. Yeah. yeah. Well, here's the other thing, too. They they charged like $5 a day for DVDs right before they rent, they filed for bankruptcy, pretty much. Yeah. So, it didn't help that they raised their price. That is creepy. Like, yeah, like... Jesus, they, they're both creepy. Yep. Oh, Kitty wrote yeah, that right. one. Uh. Listen, wow. I've had some creepy dudes in my day hit on me. I'm not going to deny that. Yeah. Jedi Padawan Daniel in gladiatorial combat. What weapon do you choose? A. Uh, the penetrator from Saints Row Two and Ah. Uh. This is the one I couldn't I couldn't get to finish in time. Oh, I thought you oh were referencing God. Gura Gura. I honestly thought you were. Yo, the penetrator <laughs> from Saints Row Two is a two and a half foot dildo sword. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I remember. Uh. Oh You're God, just saying dude. I'm asking for it. <laughs> I don't remember from that one. <laughs> oh, God. I want PlayStation Jeez, again. Oh my God. Yeah, if I didn't get timed out, I could, I could have, I would have had a, dip, I would have had an answer. Sadly, I didn't have one. <laughs> okay. Oh, whoa. Okay. Should be a patch that lets you play blank on your farm. Have fun. Be a furry. And now it's time to vote for your favorite. I'm gonna go. With uh, but they, my answer would have been uh, to the one about me is that it's is that they threatened to shoot a Starlight Glimmer plushie. But but you should destroy a Starlight Glimmer plushie. I'm a Starlight Glimmer fan, okay. I know. I, I would have said like um a human uh, I, I would say like or a, a lightsaber. Farm. Sam, I like Star uh, Starlight. Also. Yeah, either a Starlight, or either threaten a Starlight Glimmer plushie, or use a uh, lightsaber. Ah, I see. Alright, round three. I think it's accurate that I chose the coffee because I'm buried in last place. <laughs> I have no idea to see your ranks. Responses. Got all that? Good. <clears throat> Gonna get a snack while I wait for you to finish. So that's how they make the Starbucks drinks. Chance. All right. Four, three, oh, two, I couldn't think of one. The last one. God damn it. Oh, I couldn't no, think of the last no. one either. I just put a like a random yeah. shot in the dark. Three hundred trends of the yeah. summer will be blank, blank, and blank. Something, something politics. Something, something Twitter. YouTube shit getting together. <laughs> surfing, <laughs> channel surfing, surfing the internet. Uh, I mean, they're both the same thing. Yeah. 
Yeah, when true. all else fails, just make it grandma. Twitter. True, true. <clears throat> Actually surprised I won that one. Three, two, that round, nobody's asking for. Oh no. Oh boy. Where was the perfect? Oh yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, you know what? I, w I would have said like Jeffrey Dahmer. That's what I would have said. <laughs> Jeffrey Dahmer. Jeff Epstein. Um, Jeffrey Jeff Dahmer Epstein. is a serial, ki was a serial killer. Oh. Yeah. I literally could not think of anything. Oh, fuck. Hitler's <laughs> news. <laughs> oh, that was horrible. The three most important rules of your own private tickle club? This is a fetish. This is a fetish. Mom, come pick me up. I'm scared. Bad, bad touch. <laughs> bad touch. Bad touch. <laughs> Strange danger. danger. <laughs> out of this house. Out of this house. Yeah, now that, uh, that's funny. <laughs> Riley, what the fuck did you link? God damn it. I came back and I posted waiting for you guys to be done. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes. Starlight Glimmer Starbucks. Glim Glam of the Zim Zam. Forget you're to uh, say the wrong thing. Remember embarrassing moments. Reverb, <laughs> reverb fart. Anime nose bleeds a small pee. That's not how I remember our first date, dear. <laughs> the reverb fart was funny, was but the funny. other two, I was starting to just like no. I like the small pee. <laughs> the small pee is just no. What's with everybody in pee? I'm a sucker for dicks. <laughs> Yeah, but, oh, but, but, urine, oh, but, but oh, urination is so gross. Yeah, I the last yeah, one. Yeah, I, I never I understood the appeal of that. Yeah, I'm sorry, R. Kelly. Yeah. Wait. Oh, what? Wow. Damn. Go. How? Oh, good job. Great. Okay. Okay. Whatever. Um. Wow. You thought it was Ninja, but it was actually Golden all along. Yeah. Right, yeah. Well, yeah. Disney Media. <laughs> I love that. Yeah, that was the real one. The Penetrator of Saints Row 2. Yeah. Golden Wheel, like, two. Two. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Golden yeah. Be like <sighs> it was me, Dio. Come on down. Even <laughs> with the Penetrator from Saints Row 2. 100%, okay, baby. Is that the only two answers they're showing here? I think so, yeah. Yes. Looks like I think of it. I guess uh, Quick Watch does it for Disney Media and uh, Penetration. That's funny. That's I wanted to see my answer show because I didn't expect to get a Quick Blash off of that I one. Wish I wish I got more say, like, yeah. interesting I just, questions. <laughs> Ass. I get 100% on that. More asses. <laughs> more more asses. I honestly didn't expect to get 100% on that one, but I'm glad I did because that was hilarious. <laughs> oh, that was funny. <laughs> I'm gonna set up the next round right quick as I have to go refill my dog's football. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and call it a night on the stream and you guys can definitely take care of um you know your Likewise. Fun. Yeah, with like the different calls you can do. Anybody who participated in the stream, thank you very much for sticking around. Uh this is my last night of gaming streaming for this year. I'll be going back sometime in January. In the meantime, I hope you guys, you know, have a fun Christmas in advance. Expect some streams during the season, but not as much. Um, it's going to be a little bit on the random side. I can't make any promises of whatever dates will happen. But they come and they come. And uh, I have... I may do some, like, editing streams, you know. Just... I do have a lot of projects to get out there. So I'm going to... I'm going to be quite the busy boy. So. Just decorate it with, like, spring yeah. shit. Christmas. But yeah, the, uh, there's going to be a lot to come, you know, considering that, <laughs> yeah, like, December's, December's always a big year for uploading videos. Anyway, um, <laughs> hope you guys have a good night. Yeah. You too. Yeah, you too. Yeah.